Good morning, everybody. How are you? <clears throat> I am doing well. Um, if you close your eyes and you listen to my voice, does it sound like I'm on radio? Uh, should I be on radio? I've always thought I should be in with my voice, you know. Hey, this is Chris at Late Night. Coming to you live. Bringing you the songs of love. How about that? Does that sound good? <laughs> anyway, good morning, y'all. I'm up a little early this morning, so I'm going to go in a little early. Um, so we're wiping the sleep out of my eyes. Um, anyway, Kathy, I saw your video, and um, you want to check out Suspicious... Sus I can't say it. Suspicious Observers. Ben Davidson, good stuff on the on the on the sun. The coronal holes um, allow the um, solar wind to um, increase, and depending on where the solar hole or the coronal holes are, they could uh, couple up with with Earth, depending on where we are, etc. Um, that is what blows back the magnetosphere and uh, hits our shields. Um, we just had uh, three or four days of very high, uh, excuse me, activity uh, because we had some serious wind coming at us. I mean, I forget what the, what the miles were, but it was millions and millions and millions of miles fast. Um, we do have a sunspot that was coming through, but it is starting to fade out again. So it doesn't look like anything is going to happen there. Um, we have no uh, filaments to talk of or anything like that that lifted up and, and went north. Um, won't hit us. Um, so check him out. That's what those are. The coronal holes allow the solar wind to stream out faster. Um, so, anyway, um, it's Tuesday, it's my wife's birthday, um, I don't know if I said anything or not, but, uh, I got to hang out with UB40, um, uh, the other night, um, uh, that was really cool. Matt, uh, the M man, um, I'm not going to say names, but the, uh, the last name, um, he was a great guy. I got to get in touch with him, uh, beginning of September, uh, reference to Steel Pulse. They're coming to town here and, uh, they know them really well because they live in the same area. And played with him the night before in Detroit, so... Tonight they're in Philly, I believe. Yeah, yesterday they were somewhere else in Pennsylvania, but tonight they're in Philly, then they get to New York. Uh. <clears throat> so, I gotta get off early today. I've gotta be here for the repairman, for the refrigerator. Um... And my wife is off. She's here with her family. She, well, her family is here from Florida. Her brother and sister in law and their kids. And uh, I think they're going to an escape room today. They're going to get pictures, uh, something. And then after their escape room, then I'm going to meet them for, for dinner because I got to be at that here at 3 to 5 for the refrigerator repair ban because it costs less to repair the damn refrigerator than to uh, buy a new one the size that we have and where we have it. So, um, other than that, guys, not too much is going on. Just keep an eye on the skies. Look up. Um, if you have any questions, uh, let's, let's go for it. Ask me questions. Um, I will do my best to find the answers. Um, I have not heard much more on, uh, 
China Lake. Um, there are two to four hundred earthquakes there a day up through there and up through the valley of the Koso fields. Um, I was watching Dabu 7 last night and uh, the plate of Juan de, the plate of Juan de Fuca uh, right next to um, the Cascadia plate and so forth. <laughs> uh, a piece of it may fall off and it's dying and um, if that happens that could create a major earthquake there with tsunamis but it also could trigger the uh, San Andreas Fault which would not be good um, what else did I see I'm going to start writing this stuff down so I have a, a list of what to what to say um really that's about it um I'm, I'm up and alive the date and shooting suck um El Paso shooting suck all shooting suck we get killings here in Cincinnati you know daily nightly um like Wichita I would imagine um It's sad. It really is. Um, I really don't know what the answer is, guys. I mean, part of it's mental health. Part of it is hate. Part of it is having the gun in the first place. I mean, uh, I have guns, so don't tell anybody. I'm not coming to get mine. <clears throat> I will defend myself before that happens. But... Um, mine just sit there I have rounds and I have a high powered rifle took down a bear so I you know I don't understand the thought process um, either they don't have someone to talk to which does not isn't good um, I, I don't know guys I really don't I don't know the, what the motivation is and what that stuff is I don't, I don't think anybody knows it's really hard and touchy on the subject and, and it's uh, I don't know love you guys be good prepare don't be scared. Everything's going to turn out okay if you uh, have a plan. And, um, you know, if something happens, we need a point of reference to meet so we can all hunker down together and rebuild or whatever. So, anyway, um, again, you guys be good. Have a good day. I will... Uh, See you tomorrow, hopefully. Um, God willing. And uh, it is two minutes to eight here, Cincinnati, actually Loveland, Ohio, uh, on this fine Tuesday, August 6th. Be good.